And last but not least, episode five, the attic of the toy house. And you can see toys right off the bat, as you'd expect. And I'll give you some perspective. And there's Dennis. Dennis, Hello. good to see you. Me too. So Come why on. don't we start right in the back, and we somewhat stage this. So, as usual, this is unopened. Right. This piece here. Mm -hmm. We have a nylon truck. I'm noticing back here, we have an in-the-box truck from... Structo. Structo. What's that? The 40s? The 50s? Yeah, it's the 50s, Lou. 50s. Mm -hmm. We have the firefighter, the steel safe nylon here, mm -hmm. unopened. So here we have some interesting things. We've got the motocross team. Right. That's kind of cool. That's not it. That's from the 70s. That's from the 70s. We'll look in this box. We've got the 70s hot rod. Mm -hmm. Very nice there. The tomato can. And we'll look inside the box and we see we've got the stables. Yeah, and let me let me show this one because this looks pretty cool. Oh, oh, hot rods with the little hot rods. With the little hot rods. Yeah, the little sports car pulling the hot rods. So we have that right there. That's pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that's sweet. And the horse stables, as you can see. It goes right back in the box like that. And you pull the horse stables out. It's a Chevy Blazer. Chevy Blazer. And you got the horses in the trailer back there. Yeah, you there you can see them in there, can't yeah, you? Yeah, I can. Mm -hmm. Now we have the Nylant Jumbo Hauler, mm -hmm. and the Jumbo Hauler is still, well, in the box. Yeah, that's not been opened. <laughs> it's not one of those sealed... Sealed bids. Mm -hmm. Over here, also not opened, the Tonka truck, still, well, that one might have been opened. Yeah, this has been opened. Okay, yeah. that's been opened. Yeah. The Buddy L. Yeah. The farm set, that doesn't look that's, open. That's sealed. This is something my wife bought me for Christmas one Mac year. Mac tools. Mac tools, that's kind of neat. The, the, the jumbo steamroller mm -hmm. doesn't look like it's been opened. No, this is sealed. All right, some of these boxes we just won't open, but we will go show you more than enough stuff. This one here. Remember the Buddy L? I was going to show this to you, Luke. Yeah, please. Remember the Buddy L uh, school bus that was downstairs yes. in the basement? Yeah. Here's the station wagon version of in it. In episode four. Right, in episode four. This is the station wagon. Oh, that's they, cool. And they made a country square also with the wood trim. I see the word Buddy L right yeah, there. Yeah, on the wheels. Yeah. Well, on the wheels, does it say Ford? No, it says, oh, it says Buddy, it says Buddy, L, Buddy L, L. Buddy L everywhere. Buddy L. But it's actually a 63 Ford station wagon. The country sedan. See, the tailgate opens up in the back. Nice. So, yeah. That, but I wanted to show you the difference. You got a... A two, 2884 train engine there. Mm -hmm. We have a, we have here a Structo dump truck, hydraulic dump right, hauler right. in the box. Here, what year is that? You think 53? That, that, that's probably 53, 54, could be 55. It's a buddy L. I mean, it's a Structo, Structo. It's a hydraulic dump truck. Structo dump truck with box. Mm -hmm. So here we've got. The emergency kit nylon. Maybe it will just stay on one side. Yeah. Okay, so here we've got really cool. This is a really race nice team set. set. Right. From the 60s. And we have the race cars. We have the hauler. Like, even, you know, and, they were so detailed. Look, it even says Ford on the hubcaps. See it? Yeah. And, and these are the econo liners. This is the little pickup, and that's the van. And this just pulls up. Right. And shuts down. Right. So you see that race mm -hmm. box there. Mm -hmm. I'm going to move this just over here for a moment. Okay, so let's go right to this box here. We've got, uh, I'll let you hold. You're right, I'll hold this hold it for you. Okay. And we've got the Model T, yeah. the nylon pickup truck. Right. Here's a little Bronco. The Bronco. I see the word end loader. Mm -hmm. so they've got an end loader. It looks like a little bobcat. Right. 
We've got a steamroller, and we'll just do this. Keep that on. There we go. And we've got a steamroller. And we've got a wrecker. Oh, a wrecker. Mm -hmm. I see the word. I think it's, it's standard oil. Amico. Amico. So this this is another advertising piece. Amico, yeah. Mm. Oh, they got it. They did a lot of advertising toys. Also, notice so yeah, it look has, at the back. Yeah, go see. Ahead. It's I'll got to hold that for a second. It's got the cadet thing. It's like a transfer. See, on the back, still intact. Still intact. And we'll put that one back mm -hmm. in its box. Like this, like that. We'll put that one back in. She's got the little motorcycle. Viking Bronco. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll go right to this nylon 18 wheeler box. We've got the Hertz truck, mm -hmm. 18 wheeler. We have the the cattle hauler. The cattle hauler. <laughs> That's great. All the plastic toys. All the plastic cattle. We have another cattle, cattle cadet. Truck. It's a different one. Different one. Not not much different. But this one's got mm -hmm. the GMC. Yeah. 915. Cattle hauler. We'll have the cows see each other. Here was our 18-wheeler Hertz with the little aerodynamic front on it. Mm -hmm. Very cool. The sleeper, the sleeper cab. Yeah. yeah. Then we have the Nylant GMC. Tell you what, why don't you pick up that front yeah, part? Yeah, let's the box. Just like that. You got her? Yep. And we'll turn that around. This is the Atlas. Atlas Van Lines. Atlas Van Lines. With the antennas. Mm -hmm. Nice. We'll put that one mm -hmm. back in. Oh. Now we'll come over here to the tanker, the nylon. This pony farm looks a little yeah, older. That, that's from the 60s. That's you can tell by the box. Ford Conliners. Yeah. It's a very nice piece. And then right along with it, you have the little, little toe doom buggy thing. Yeah. Dune buggy. We have the trailer. Mm -hmm. Then the Gamble's Chevy semi. And you got the. What's the scooper? That's, oh, that's old. Be careful. With that yeah, box. I see. Yeah, yeah. yeah I think I'm going to just leave it in there. We're going to do this with that one. Yeah. We're going to do this. Yeah. Leave that one in there. And then the Gamble's truck. 1969 That's when that was made. Yeah. See it? Yeah. On the scraper. Yeah, right there. I'll take that light out. This is kind of cool. We've got the Cadet Camp and Cruise. Mm-hmm. Then we have our race cars again. Then you got another set of race cars in a different color. In fact, I think I got the same set there twice. All right. Take this up here. Okay. We'll just consider that the same set as we just saw there. Yeah, with just well, a this has got a bolt. Okay, now these got the race cars. See, they're the same. See? They're, they're, I got a double of them. Perfect. Now, this is Brooklyn collectible. Yeah, those are those are die cast. Those are Brooklyn. Those are very collectible. And what they are, they got a lot of them live in production. A lot of them are only made so many of this, so many of that. And we won't take them out, but no. there's the 56 Lincoln Premier. That's kind of a rare one. Yeah. And they're they're exact detail of the real car. So those are more high end. Yeah, these are more high end. What's on the end of that one? This is a uh, 1951 Ford Victoria. Okay. These are all. I can see another yeah. Lincoln Premier. Yeah. Yeah. This is a different manufacturer. This one. This is a convertible with a top down. The other yeah. one was a hard top. So all the Brooklyn toys here. Zero box cars. These, so are, are, these are 55 Fords. They came in the cereal box in 55 in post cereals. Wow. And then these, let's see what these are. Yeah, these are the 54s. They, they made the Mercury's and the Fords in 54. 
Okay. These are rare. These are harder to come by. And they break real easy because if you look, see, yeah, here's one with a busted. Right. Yeah, there's one that's got a busted windshield. But uh, here, find a good one. See? Yeah. That's a two-door sedan, and they actually made the hard top, which is, there's a station wagon. They made every model. Oh. Which, tell, tell me about this dollhouse. Okay, that I found an antique store up in Plano. And it's original, it's never been put together. You won't find too many dollhouses in the original box. This is from the 50s, it was made by Marx. And there's there's all the tin pieces, the assembly. Here's, here's the track paper between each piece so it doesn't get scratched. This is all original paper and everything. There's the sides of it. You can see as you go through it, see? Yeah. This, yeah. Next row. Yeah, but uh, we'll put that all back together. Yeah, we yeah. won't play too much with that one. No, untouched and untouched. unscathed. Yeah, I see we've got while well, you're doing that, we've got the Nylant pig farm over here. So we've got the emergency crew here, along with a uh, we have your all an army version of that. Yeah, right. So we've got the army version and Ronald McDonald. We'll put that back in. And for the moment, we'll take that box and just mm -hmm. move it over here so we can look up right, on, right beneath it. We'll put it right here because that's going to go on top of this. Mm -hmm. So here we have the all nylon mover. Check out the outfits. Now, these are in sealed boxes. These boxes Check out the pants. Yeah. <laughs> Clearly very 70s. So there's nothing to do here. This is just all mm -hmm. showing you the toys and the mm -hmm. payloader and the husky dump. And then here we have a nylon trans tanker. Mm -hmm. Here we have a whole bunch of tiny tankas. Yeah, whole set of them. And then here we've got the boom dozer. Yeah, a lot of the stuff up in the attic are tankas. Nylon, I'm sorry. There's a mixture of everything, but mostly tank nylon. Here's that. And race car series. Mm -hmm. That's a cool set. Yeah, the motorcycle. The CB race car set. And then we've got the Metro Police. The Nylon Transporter. Oh, this is definitely 80s. Can we just go on top of this? Remember, Lou? I think it can, yeah. This one here? Yeah. Okay. So there's a mini catalog you can see. Okay. Along with the 80 Z28 and the Firebird Trans Am. Mm -hmm. Looks kind of like a Smokey and the Bandit simulated mm -hmm. CB antenna. Yeah, that's like a newer Trans Am, isn't it? From the 80s. Well, yeah. Yeah. And then cool. we'll just grab that for a second. Mm -hmm. And we can take a look at this. It's clearly older. Oh, there's a big fire truck in there. See it? The hook and ladder. You might want to leave that in there because it's hard to get out of there. Okay. I won't move the hook and ladder, yeah, yeah, but I'll sure. let you just hold that for a second. So we'll see the hook and ladder. And there's an antique farm set. That's, that, you know, that there is a 60 set. And now that's a Ford, set Ford there. Bronco. Ford. Yeah, now that is a uh, limited edition, that truck there. Is that a cool truck? That is Harley, isn't it? Yeah. Well, this one says Moose. Oh, it's a Moose truck. Okay, that's another one. I got a Harley too that's limited edition. Let me see where that's at. That may not be this new. might be the Harley. This says Milwaukee. No, that's a Milwaukee tool truck. No, the Harley's not in there. I got one, the Harley, but. The Milwaukee tool truck. Yeah. yeah, this is a rare truck. I'm gonna put this back in the box. And there's a GMC. Another GMC. Let me pull out one of those. Texaco Star. Private label. All private label toys. The Tiger.
Tom Sneva racing team. So here's the horse trailer. This goes in here. This. Yeah. Yeah, this one. No, that's, that's an older one there. That's. Yeah, see, you can tell by the. That's a Bronco. No. It's a movie van. The Chevy. And then went there. This is all done back here, right? Luke? Yep. The Metro Police truck. The Maxim moving van. Featuring a slide out ramp. Very cool. Here's the Brinks security truck. Now, this is pretty interesting. Mm -hmm. The Brinks security truck. Yeah, isn't that neat? Clearly, it's a bank. Oh, yeah. And you can see it's got a code for the back door to open it up. Let me show that one. Here. So, here's your Brinks truck. Mm -hmm. With a code, as you can see. I'm lost over here. Oh, I'll let you finish that out. I'll let you figure that out. And then we're here. The crane. That's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. With the crane there. Let's just look at this one. The jumbo loader. We won't take that out of the box. But this, in this yeah. box, we've got some convertibles. Yeah, now these were made... These were made... In the 80s, I'll take this Thunderbird off. Show you what it looks like. While you're getting that out, we'll take a look back here. The Nylon Grand Prix. See? Oh wow, those are nice. Yeah, they can't. Yeah, they're very nice. They're a copycat of the original Japanese friction cars. And they're very well executed. Super quality. They made the hard top and the convertible in all the different colors. You can buy these things. I don't miss that friction motor is. Yeah. This is a 56 Thunderbird. It's got the Continental kit on it. Mm -hmm. Then they came with a serial number and then they came with their own title. Nice. Okay. Wow. And you put your name on it and there's the serial number on the license plate. To match so it. yeah, each one has its own. Wow. And then we have the Nylant trucks here. We'll just show you. Like so, this one's actually still front. in the box, the race team. I'll do that. I'll do that. You can see that there. The Green Island Classic Pumper. Oops. The Island Corvette Bass Chaser. Like shopping, huh? Yeah, we've got the Pepsi Gotta Have It connected with the Lipton tea bag trucks, like so. Combined with the Pepsi truck, and you can see there's one more down there as well. I'm gonna move that for the moment right here. Dennis, tell me about this one. This crane. Oh, this this is a this is an old buddy L, probably from between 1910 and 1920, Lou. Wow. It's real heavy metal. Old buddy L crane. I got a couple of those. You pick that up for a second. Sure. Here, let me grab. It. Go ahead, you know? Yeah. I'll just show. We got buddy L. You can see the metal wheels. Okay, we'll put that back. We have some jumbo dozers. We've got the oven, we've got the spoiler, the trailblazer, the jungle wagon, complete with animals, the top loader, the husky mixer, the road grader.
little pumpkin cadet toe. Mm -hmm. The cattle rancher. Another cattle rancher. Cadet pickup. The jalopy. Last boxes. You can tell by the cost that was less. You got the little toe. The jalopy. This goes back in the box, Luke? Over here? Yeah, that one goes in that You're box. You're done with this? Yeah, it goes right down there. It goes all fit in that box. Mm -hmm. The husky mixer. Still in the box. No visual to that one. Nylet. There's a, a nylet. There's a big jumbo bulldozer in there. Like, that one's all in the. Yeah, it's in the box. See? The jumbo dozer. All jumbo. right, we'll put those back. We've got this rare oven, which you can see actually has a temperature, some on off switches. There. This, what this is. This is all the true scale. I show you those trucks down in the basement made mm -hmm. by true scale. You saw that one tracker. This is what's left of that set. Now the trucks were more part of this, but these are all made by true scale. They're implement pieces, farm equipment. Farm equipment. See, like you got a grain elevator. I wrapped them all in bags so they wouldn't get scratched in this box. You see, they got a, a grain elevator. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, and to find it in this condition, it's it's really rare. Really it's, rare. It was from a collector, a, a guy that bought his dad bought them new and wouldn't let him play with them. So he, I bought them in an antique store. And the guy, I talked to the owner. He said, "Yeah, they were his since they were brand new. We never played with them." But there, there's like cultivators, stuff like that. All kinds of. And then over here we have got some banks. Yep. We got a nylon end loader. In here. And a couple of. Japanese tin curves. Yeah. Okay. Well, just, that's all I have to well Dennis, we've got this is episode five of five, our final episode. What an amazing house. What an amazing group of toys you have. I'm so glad at Christmas time to share the toys. Thanks, Dennis, so much for being with me. You're welcome. I'm glad to have you. I'm glad to share them with other people. So that's what they're for. <laughs>